Salute to Seniors is presented by K-1 Speed and Trampoline Zone and Mission Linen. News Channel 21 is sending off the class of 2023 with a salute twice a week. We've shown you what's special about the graduating classes. Now we take a trip to Prineville to meet with Crook County's seniors. It's a big school that still keeps to its small town roots. I think that we all know each other really well. A lot of us have gone to Crook County High School and Crook County Middle School together since the beginning. So it's really been like a benefit. I would say it's a, it's a culture of support and togetherness. We, we are a larger school uh, compared to many rural schools, but we're also, we have that rural feel. And so there's definitely a feeling of closeness and everyone kind of knows everyone. And I think that's kind of helped and you know, you have more of that one-on-one -on -one with your teachers um, compared to other high schools, which just don't have those. This school definitely has more electives, more options. I think the teachers are very helpful. That beginning of junior year, I started my construction in the construction program and then uh, kind of made my journey through there and we started doing some off-campus projects. I built a very good relationship with my teacher in there. Uh, I just like working with my hands. I learned a lot that I didn't know at all before I went in. Just building stuff is cool, learning how to do it. This class has achieved such great things and we have kids that are going on to the workforce. We have kids that are going to prestigious colleges. We're having a remarkable year in athletics. Um, we have students in performing arts that are qualifying for state and being recognized. And it's just really cool to see that they, they made it through all the, I guess, barriers or distractions and uh, they're finding their own way and they're doing it well. So we do have a senior trip like what we do every year. I think we're going to Washington Family Ranch. It's just another opportunity for us to get to see each other one last time before we all break off and go our own individual ways. I think it's like a really bittersweet moment because, you know, we've been together since the beginning. We all know each other. We see each other at the store. And now suddenly, 12 years later, we're all going our own separate ways, and some of us will probably never see each other again. Crook County's commencement ceremony is underway right now in Ward Roden Stadium. 226 graduates will walk, including online students and homeschoolers. 